All right, we're going in 30 seconds. Remember, stay on the mic. I know you get excited and move around when you're talking and stuff. We won't be able to hear you at all if you come out right like that. If you go anywhere, there you go. Hey, we're with Kimmy and in the morning. Uh, happy Wet Tuesday. It's 8.35. Look for a high today of about 86. I don't know if we're going to get there to 75 right now. And it is special guest time in the A1A studio. We don't normally do a lot of guests. Oh, so we brought in the studio audience, didn't we? Brought in the studio audience and studio <laughs> guests, ladies and gentlemen. Them. We have a local celebrity here, WWE, or W, is it WE or WWE? WWE. Yeah, uh, the WWE Network, come on, WWE. WWE. I, I gotta keep up with the board. Little Boogie Man, Chris Holyfield, how are you, buddy? Thank you, Timmy, I'm glad you invited me here this morning, because you know we're talking about a serious subject that I talk about around the country, is on bullying. Yeah, we, uh, I know, I've known Chris for how long, man? Since I was kind of tall, but I'm just kind of... <laughs> how tall are you? I'm four foot four. Four foot four, and the man uh, knows about bullying and knows about things that are going on. You travel around the country and talk to schools and students about bullying, right? Absolutely, Timmy. Anywhere from the U.S. to Canada. I've uh, been doing this for over 13 years now. So you've been everywhere, but yet yeah, you are actually from here. You're from Brevard. Can you tell Brevard us a little County. bit about where, where you came from here? So, uh, you know, I've been in Brevard County for over 33 years. Went to Palm Bay High School. Nice. Yes, you know, wrestled on the high school team. Mm -hmm. And um, it's just been, uh, you know, it's no place like home. But I uh, always enjoyed being able to travel to other schools around the country yeah. and uh, try to make a difference. See, that's what's so important, is, is making a difference, like spending a lot of your time making a difference. And why is it so important to you to focus on bullying? Why, why is it so important? You know, the, the, I know a lot of people out there that if they do know me, if they don't know me, I'm four foot four, and I was born with dwarfism, mm -hmm. which causes you not to grow. And uh, you know, so your limbs are shorter than the average person. Your arms and your legs are shorter, but your upper body is the same size. But my thing was, I went through a few experiences of being bullied, but it wasn't like all my life. It was just some things that I didn't like. And as I got older, I saw things going on with other you know, kids and stuff. Mm -hmm. And I handled it totally different because I'm, I'm a different breed. But for the other students that don't know how to handle it, I felt that it was in me to try to make that difference. So here it is, the first of school. So we thought, you know, bullying, it doesn't seem to go away. A lot of people are talking about it, but it doesn't seem to go away. Uh, so we thought we'd bring Chris in, to, who's, I guess you'd call a professional, bullying speaker, if you will, uh, to talk about this and to talk to kids about what they're doing. They may not even realize it. Yeah, you know what happens is that, you know, people, they normally judge you from a distance because they really don't even know you from, from, from first hand. And then if it's that visual difference about you, whether it's the, way, the clothes that you wear or the way you may walk or anything that's, that's a little different that's not of the norm, it, it makes you a target as it made me a target. But for the ones that are targeted now, they take the situation in, in their own hands, and a lot of times that's not for the better. So uh, uh, what we're going to do here is, uh, Chris is going to stick around a while if you want to give us a call, 9410711799 wba one a and have any questions for him, or they can go to your website if they don't have time to call right now. Yes, it's www.gotrespecttour.com. Gotrespecttour.com, all one word, all together. Chris, thanks for coming by, buddy. Thank you, bud. Victims out there that opportunity to see that hey don't let a bully stop you from your dreams because mm -hmm. people are going to say stuff about you and you know, you're going to let that stop you from being that happy person let that stop you from growing as an individual mm -hmm. so you know when I show them that videotape and they have no clue that I'm at the school so I'm behind the curtain just hanging out and then after that uh, oh that's a, a cool way to do yeah, it because so, yeah. it's like that that uh, optical illusion of like okay we're seeing a video and the same guy's coming out Oh, and it's like, oh, snap, yeah. he's here. And then now you, it, it's like, um, it gives that thought process like, man, I was laughing at him on that video because he was so short. But I didn't realize he was going to be coming out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so they, were, they made fun of me from a distance. Right. But when I come out, it's like, oh, 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 you know, they got all these yeah. questions. Oh, can I get an autograph? Oh, can I get all these things? So, yeah. <laughs> I think so, yeah. All right, ready? One, two, three. Nice. All right, go on over there. I'll get a picture of you guys. Perfect. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.